Welcome back to part 6 of the post-comp progress. I saw a big beam and I got excited, but it's actually just an effigy. Damn it. Oh wait, with an effigy that means I gotta get the XP, so it is crafting over agility. And then I pick uh, cooking over fire making. I will pick rune crafting over summoning. And smithing over mining. And then, bam, this is going straight into Slayer. 64k. Click, click, there we go. Oh, well, it happened at kind of a rough time for me to make a clip, but there's the Dark Soul, which I think is the rarest of the pieces, I want to say. I'm not entirely sure. I'm going to check on the wiki, but uh, there's one-third of the Penny Pet. Wait, can I, can I right-click and see? No, okay, it doesn't say. So I couldn't actually do a voiceover for that clip because my, my girlfriend was asleep behind me, didn't want to wake her up. Uh, but yeah, I got some dragon limbs at just 31 kill count. I went there for a slayer task, I'm gonna go back to try and get the soul uh, eventually. But I'm I'm just blown away that I ended up getting, getting those limbs, so uh, you know, if I get that last signet, I've got the bow. Oh wonderful, I just completed a scroll mission, and that means I have access to the vampirism scrimshaw. Uh, not sure what I'm gonna go for next. I guess, um, yeah, probably magic accuracy, because I think that's what people use at Telos, but yeah, so once I get some more uh, ancient bones, I can finally use vampirism. There we go, 460 tasks done. I got a Dagonoth task right after that last clip, and <laughs> a Dagonoth King's Reaper as well. Perfect. Hey, virtual range level 109. I really, like, like, why do abilities cast if I'm typing? Like, okay, say I'm typing 4 right now. You see, there's nothing on my bar. If I type, if I click F, winter storage, why does it, why does it do that? Like, if I click D, it doesn't eat a shark. But if I click F, it just banked my bow. So I, I'm, I'm just going to go finish up on uh, Waterbirth instead of at uh, Dagonoth King since I already got the, um, what's it called, the Reaper task taken care of. But I mean, come on! And during this Corrupted Warrior task, I just got uh, Sleigh Bell's Ring number 4. Uh, so that's 5k kills here in the Softenum dungeon. And I got uh, all of the Corrupted Creature Souls as well as... Uh, let me see, like the first three acts? Oh yeah, earlier I got the uh, the Scarab. I didn't make a clip for that, so uh... Yeah, that's really not that bad, I don't think. Well, I really don't know how bad this is gonna be for my bank, but I want some of these items. The uh, the gold bars, the prayer potions, uh, the alkables, the summoning foci here. Yeah, so I'm just gonna click it. Uh, I got some organization to do. Nice, magic level 113. Um, this is my third corrupted creature task, back to back to back, and I... Oh man, I'm, I'm honestly kind of sick of these guys, but uh, I think they're pretty good XP, so I shouldn't complain. Well, I put in two more attempts into Tertius, thanks to a uh, fairly lucky ascension creature task. Like 140 kills, and I got uh, four keys from it, two of them being what I need, but... This failed. No signets. And as I'm waiting for a full raid to get together, there's a hard clue done. Meh. Gonna go finish this elite. Alright, got my uh, BM here. And that's some crap loot, but I'm not gonna re-roll it. Going to re-roll uh, Yaka right after this with one of my re-roll tokens. Alright, here's the Yaka. Collect loot from Yaka. I mean, that's... That's not that bad, honestly. That's quite a bit of Alkables. Good techie, but I'm going to re-roll it anyway. Okay. I was hoping for today to be my my, uh, my first Codex drop, but no. I have a feeling that this might be the end of this next hard clue. Yep, there we go. And hey, got my first new unique. That's H3. Uh, I did say, I think in the last video, that I'm going to start going for the, uh, the various collections. So there's something. And here's an Elite Casket unlock 
And there's 470 tests complete. Another try here at Tertius, and uh, let's see, Signets or not. And... No. Used a VIP ticket to get Nihils for the first time, and uh, nice, got the soul right off the bat. Um, so many random drops here, and uh, yeah, I brought food, even though I probably don't need like any at all. Um, going to probably prefer this once I end up getting the Cinderbane gloves from uh, the new guys. Mostly because I've only gotten like five pouch ingredients this hour. Or, I mean, this this task, sorry. About uh, 56 kills, if I remember correctly. And, yeah, only uh, enough for like four or five pouches. And people use them all over the place. Uh, this is something I was not aware of how difficult it is to get these pouches. So, uh, yeah, I'd like to come back over and over again while I'm going for 120 Slayer. And uh, stock up on them a little bit. Tertius key number four today. And nothing. However, uh, even though I did not get the Signet right there, which would have been absolutely amazing, I can pull off the Siphons, siphon my gear, and here's something pretty fun. 100 million XP in Invention. And just a little bit more. For the last firework. Oh, I think now might be a uh, good time to mention that down in the description, or pinned on a comment, uh, you will find a straw poll link. Uh, there's a question that uh, somebody kind of wants me to ask everybody. And uh, it's about my, like, upload schedule, I guess. There's not much of a schedule right now, it's just kind of whenever I feel like a video is ready. Uh, but the question's, it's going to be asking about, uh, you know, if you guys want to see uploads more often, or like on a more regular basis. Uh, I know people like a friend or Alkin will do them like every three, four days most of the time. Um, and some people have been asking, you know, if I, if I can upload a little more often like that. Um, yeah, so feel free to respond to the poll. If you don't want to, that's totally okay. Um, but if you do have a strong preference, uh, one way or the other, uh, be sure to respond to it. Oh, hey, there's 110 Slayer. Pretty nice. 10 levels to go. Sadly, that doesn't unlock anything. And it's 4 million XP until I get, uh, I think, the Gorilla Axe. Here we go, another Elite Casket. For nothing. Oh, I just uh, missed it because I didn't have OBS open. But uh, there's 111 HP. Just doing some more Manifest Shadows. Need one more soul from them to fill out all the slots in my uh, dungeon. Except for the one, what is it, Blissful. That I'm keeping there to try and get the uh, the one in two thousand piece. All right, here's another elite casket and uh, dragon staff. Is that like a unique item? I've never heard of that before. Dragon staff. I'm actually looking on the wiki right now. Dragon staff, elite clue scroll. Huh. It gives fortunate components. Okay, so. Yeah, I'll take it, I guess. 810k. Alright, next one's a reroll. And bam, there's 480 tasks complete. Here's another hard clue. Bam! You composite bow, magic composite bow. That's two in one. That's pretty great, but uh, I think I'm going to reroll it anyway. I don't really need fortunate components. Wow. Nice, got a, uh, an essence came here to uh to bend just you know for more lance chanson well at least that's a drop and a dormant anima core helm uh remember how he got that lance yeah that means i get like all of the loot and i'm loving it uh so yeah i got a uh, <laughs> just over 1k dragon bones uh just around 300 raw sharks so i mean that's a pretty good hour, and then all of these rune kite shields that'll alk for like a mil. So I had plenty of uh, golden mystery eggs from prawn balls, and uh, came over here, got myself the last plug. So if I remove this, uh, you can see it's the stone of jazz plug. So now I have that, can throw it in. Bam! I 
thought there was going to be an achievement for this. I'm not sure. Um, maybe I didn't do it right, or maybe I have to prestige it again. I'm not sure. Uh, but I have plenty of gold mystery eggs if I do have to. Yeah. Four complete spins around the agility pyramid. Ugh. I really love these scarabs here in Minifos because, I mean, there's an onyx dragon kill, and there's an onyx dragon kill, basically. Uh, but, this last one, there we go. Boys to Minifites, there is the uh, tier 10 Minifos reputation. And there's the end of Crocodile Tears, uh, the first of the last three Minifos quests that I have to do. Here we go, another hard and elite. Hard, oh, two things. Black Cavalier and Zamorak Chaps, nice. And uh, open up this elite Ancient Rune Kite Shield. Gosh, I guess I gotta keep it again, because, uh, you know, it's new. Not gonna reroll. Oh, I really didn't expect that, but uh, 103 Prayer <laughs> here at Onyx Dragons. Alright, and on the same task with this kill, should be hearing fireworks maybe? No, no fireworks, but uh, that is 40 million Slayer XP. Um, yeah, so another milestone, just uh, 64 to go. Just lobbied after picking up that 40 mil Slayer, and I've been trying really hard, but finally did it. My rune tracker shows that I've earned 31 mil XP in the past week. Uh, 30 and a half, actually. Trying really hard to, to maintain a number like that, at least uh, 30 mil in gains per week. So, uh, yeah, pretty pretty happy. Just doing some cooking and got uh, virtual level 100. So I've been fletching here in Minifos all day, getting a little bit of reputation, and uh, basically just trying to uh, save up some parts or gather some parts for invention. I uh, want to get everything together that I need to get all the way from where I am now to 200 mil, just so I don't have to worry about making siphons or augmenters ever again, basically. Uh, so I'm going to you know, make a lot of those, and, and shield bows are a big part of that, so I've been fletching. And uh, yeah, finally got myself the magic carpet pet for the ports district. So that means I'm going to move over to the imperial district for one. And for two, let me see... Is it going to be in... Yeah, there we go. Magic Carpet Port. I'm going to call this pet just so that I can uh, get a little bit of that Magic Carpet Dust. Oh, and just for reference, by all day, I mean literally all day. I wasn't feeling up to streaming this morning, so... Uh, yeah, this stack that started at like twelve or 13,000 is now just below 4k. My Magic Shield Bow uh, Unstrung stack is pretty high. And I've gotten about uh, 440 free ones... Uh, just from the Fletching Cape perk. And uh, here's something I should have done a long time ago, but I never want to buy this book. Yes, I never want to disable Iron Man mode. There we go. It's totally okay to skull me, though. I mean, got some stuff to go buy. So I've, uh, I've lost loot once in the past from Beastmaster um, because I went and killed... Raid lock is weird. Anyway, I'm going to uh, just collect this loot that I just got from Beastmaster. Because uh, it's giving me a warning that I can lose it. So, yeah. Well, the uh, Yaka kill ended up failing. So I'm going to try to get that in uh, today or tomorrow. Going to go do some thieving and then back to divination later on today. But I've got an elite clue here. Pop that open. Wow, two pieces of ancient. Again, I can't <laughs> re-roll. Oh, man. What's wrong with my luck? Alright, guys. Uh, so this is going to end off this video. Uh, I know it's it's probably been fairly short. I haven't actually checked the uh, the total length of all of my clips for the week. For the, for the last few days. For this video, I mean. Not the week. Um, but that's, that's primarily because I've been doing a lot of skilling uh, between today and yesterday. I think I've only made like uh, three, four clips, something like that. Uh, so not too many. Uh, but the plan is to finish up doing divination uh, sometime probably day after the video goes up. And then uh, shortly after, I'll go to smithing my gold ore into gold bars. 
and after I don't know after doing a few thousand of those go back to collecting some bowstrings fletching up uh, magic bows then eventually I will end up with I want to say around 50 augmenters around 150 siphons and uh, divine charge I've currently got 500,000 in my charge pack, or, or something fairly close to it. I've got these 200 full. Uh, I've got 62 here, and I think there's 100 in here. Um, going to finish out all of those, uh, like I said, within about a day. Yeah, oh, and then I have an extra 120,000, or about uh, 40 Divine Charge worth uh, in my machines. Though that'll slowly deplete over time anyway. Um, so my, my plan with all of this is to... Hopefully not have to collect any more energy uh, till I get done with Slayer at the very least. Uh, but hopefully till I can finish off Invention. And then after that point, it's just, you know, if I get really unlucky on Malcolm, I'll, co I'll come back and get some more. Keep doing Siphons and stuff like that. Uh, otherwise, it's like, I don't know, an hour or two of Divination per week at the most. Uh, just to, you know, maintain my charges. But yeah, that's the plan, guys. I know I never made like a little goal for it on the notepad here in game because it was kind of a, sp uh, a spontaneous thing that just jumped up and felt like doing it so yeah something i've been working on uh anyway thanks for watching guys i'll see you in the next one i'm out